What the Christ am I looking at right now? <laughs> this is a game called Papui, which at first I just kind of assumed was like a sneeze. Papui. But I ran it through Google Translate and it turns out it's actually French for tickle, which is even more concerning in a game about licking things. What exactly am I supposed to be licking? Oh, oh, okay. Uh, we can avoid the arm fuzz. Yeah, I'm down for that. This is one real long arm. Um, wasn't there a hand at the other end? I definitely feel like I'm missing something. Oh, watch out for the titties. What's up guys, welcome back to the Google Play Store, where today we're going to be taking a look at one of the most popular ongoing trends, mouth games. As far as I can tell, this all started with a game called Lick Runner, which came out on the App Store. It got a whole lot of attention despite being fairly low effort, but it didn't get a Google Play Store release. So of course, all of the Google vultures came swooping in and flooded the place with knockoffs, which I'm now going to play so you don't have to. We're gonna start things off with a game called Licking Run, which I think is as close to the original Lick Runner as we're ever gonna get, but even then, that's not saying much. It'd be kind of like claiming the diarrhea is as close to turds as we're ever gonna get. <laughs> Tell that to my pants. Wait, what did that just say? Video loading error. Please try again later. They're seriously trying to run ads in the main menu, like before I've even done anything. Here I was thinking my poop joke was gonna be the shittiest part of this intro. This is why despite the fact that I'm not recording in a jumbo jet right now, I'm always playing in airplane mode. I'm assuming the idea here is to lick the food, but not the pussy. Don't take that out of context. You know, even though she's got a nose like Mr. Potato Head, with lips like those, and a tongue like that, I'd say she's still wife material. Well, I think I have a pretty good idea of how the game works, but I don't understand why people play it. And I also don't understand why I can lick scoop after scoop of ice cream, but not ice. Can you even get an ice cream headache without ice cream? Like, I'm telling you guys, between the deep-rooted philosophical questions and poop jokes, you're getting an absolute buffet of commentary today. There we go. So there's only five pieces of food per level that we need to lick. And I know I just said that her lips were a perk, but at the same time, that was before they puckered. Now I just can't stop seeing a big butthole on her face. I've also been meaning to ask, why do I have an audience? It's like a group of people sat down to a table for some Ben and Jerry's cactuses and kitties, and then a head floated by and ate everything. <laughs> it's just such a fever dream. Is it gonna get more difficult? Is it gonna get weirder? Oh, I can spend my money on stuff. You know what? I could understand stuff like donuts, tangerines, chicken wings. They lost me with poop, but then they got me right back with women. A thousand dollars to lick a woman does not sound entirely legal. And if your hooker costs as much as a stack of pancakes, then she's probably not the cleanest, but you know what? Beggars can't be choosers. This is not the pussy that I emptied my checking account for. What is happening? Why are you in my face? Oh! Oh! Wait, no, we want to lick the cats. We get points for the cats because the cats like to be licked, of course. I don't think I would want a fuzzy tongue between ice cream scoops, but I'm, I'm kind of done questioning things here. I just want to find where I invested my money. I'm not just dirty-minded, right? She's not gonna be an audience member because she was classified <gasps> under food. So she's gotta be here somewhere. Now that I know I can lick the cats, I'm really cruising. <laughs> yeah, the game is definitely picking up pace. It's becoming more of a game, but I still can't find my lady meal. I think it's safe to say we found her, but it looks like rigor mortis is set in. <laughs> and she doesn't have toes? Uh, uh, lady, are you... Okay, yeah, you're very lickable, but <laughs> not at all what I expected. <laughs> I, 
can tell you right now, the game is gonna get way too fast. It's just too much to handle. And we've clearly seen the best part of it already. I licked ice cream scoops. I licked lady scoops. I'm ready to move on to the next ripoff. No, Google Play Store, I'm just trying to download the next game, okay? I appreciate the fact that you're recommending the Mona Lisa with her tits out, but not this episode. Next up, we have a game called Lick 'em All, which is probably looking familiar by this point. Are you picking up on the trend? I'm not quite sure if the realistic faces are more or less terrifying, but I have noticed that if you wander into the shop looking for hookers, they don't have any, but they also don't have a close option, or an exit, or an X, or a back button. Like, my only options right now are to buy something or close the game, which is just a great start. All right, guy, let's lick them all. We are going to put our tongue in the ice cream again. Why is this not working? Oh, oh, okay. Uh, We gotta lower our tongue as well as the frame rate. Uh, do, do we want the noodles? We, we want the noodles. What is happening right now? <laughs> is this supposed to be ironic? Is the idea that it looks terrifying and it's about taste and it moves at the speed of smell? <laughs> We've got all the senses, and I have barely any control over what's happening. Looks like I got a four times multiplier for some reason, and a third of a woman's head. Great. What other senses are we missing? Like, touch? Feel? I, I feel uncomfortable. I, I feel confused. And uh, we've also got uh, uh, hearing. Yeah, th there's audio. I'll give them credit. Most mobile games don't have audio these days somehow. Why are we licking into the wind? C can I do something about that? Am I ever supposed to retract my tongue? Ooh, okay. Um, That might have ruined things. No, sir. I would rather not lick your boot because I lost my tongue. Or I thought I did. We definitely did just lose our tongue to that knife, right? <laughs> so why did I get more? Ooh, yeah, you know what? Come to think of it, I'll take the top third of this lady's head if it comes by. I really am trying my best here to predict when I should lower my tongue and when I shouldn't, but like, not only are my inputs delayed by seconds, no thank you, sir. <laughs> like, the game runs about as smoothly as a uh, one-legged horse. It's driving me crazy, and I don't know, like, should I be licking the cans? Is that a bad thing? I, I feel like that's a perfectly good thing. I definitely want to be licking the food. I can suck up the soup. Oh, that's not a retract your tongue button. It's a suck button. I, I thought only the game sucked, but apparently I can suck too. <laughs> so should I, uh, I, I don't know how I influence the multiplier. Maybe that's just an end result of my score, I guess? I got 100% of the woman's head, though. Can we maybe get a body to go along with her? Is that asking too much? Well, the good news is the exit button decided to come to work today so I can leave the store whenever I want. But the bad news is I didn't get to keep the lady head. After all that work, I, I gotta stick with this guy. Like, it, it could just be broken, but at the same time, I, I don't really know, and I, I don't want to try to fix things because, like, let's be honest, the developers probably can't even fix these things. What hope do I have? And I've learned one thing with these stupid games that I gotta roll with the punches, otherwise I'm never gonna be able to release a video. Oh, I see. My multiplier is on the left. So right now we're at four times, five times. All right, it's not exactly that great to watch. Don't get me wrong, and I hate the fact that it's laggy, but five times multiplier means we get ice cream and more coins that I can't spend on this strange brown person. You know what? I don't feel like buying minorities in this game. I think we're just gonna move on to the next. Next up, we've got a game called Teeth Runner, and I have no idea what the Christ I'm looking at right now. It definitely looks like it's gonna be a little bit different than the last two. Like, if I was to guess, I would say I'm some kind of coked up tooth fairy, and my job is really getting to me. Our current customization options are toothbrushes and cannons. <laughs> yeah, this should be interesting. Not really sure where the cannon is gonna come in, but I'm seeing toothpaste as well as a bunch of faces that could use it. So let's go ahead, grab some toothpaste, help you folks out. 
Again, game runs like shit. Surprise, surprise. Speaking of shit, okay. No, I, I would rather not. Oh, but I do. Because we've got a bunch of goblin heads coming up and this is their brushing preference. Oh, come on. You gotta be kidding. What is wrong with those babies? Oh, there's the cannon. <laughs> Yeah, tap, 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 tap. We gotta get the power up. Oh, my, my power is piss poor. Come on. All right. And we are gonna have to get an auto clicker for that because I can't wait to see how many more gross mouths we can get to. I don't even know where to start when commentating about this. Do you think one of these reward cards has game audio behind it? <laughs> Probably not. Right is always right. I got 50 gems. I don't think a tooth fairy can spend gems on smack though, so give me more teeth. I'm sure having mustard colored teeth is a real bummer, but at the same time, I don't think it should be their main priority, considering their severed faces uh, on the dream road that is my booger sugar fueled nightmare. <laughs> So they might want to prioritize getting out of here, but what do I know? Right? I'm just the guy who's trying his best to brush with poop. Yeah, oh, uh, all right. Gonna scratch some teeth? Yeah, I'll, I'll do my best. Oh, it was like a scratch-off ticket, but somebody's mouth, and I got a seven times multiplier? I'm so confused right now. I said it before and I'll say it again, right is always right. What have you got for 250 gems? Which I still can't spend, so can I get cryptocurrency or something, please? I don't suppose the shit-eating goblins accept gemstones as currency, would they? Oh, am I not supposed to go for the guy with the tongue? Why not? You would think that he wants to be brushed in anyway, because we don't want the spikes, that's for sure. Well then fine, you can just sit there and suck it. I don't really want to pick up speed, though. Speed is bad. Speed is where my frame rate dies. And I can't buy any more of that. Like It's just such a piss off. I don't understand. My computer, which is what I'm using right now, I'm playing this on a computer, can play any video game. Teeth Runner is not the crisis of 2022. Okay, we gotta scratch off some more teeth. Um, Let's go with this one and this one and this one because Right is always right. No, okay, six times multiplier, screw it. And I unlocked a bone. A bone for what? I guess we'll never know because they wanted me to watch an ad to unlock it. I did manage to get some kind of barbecue brush. Doesn't quite look like a paintbrush. I, I, I think I can also get a new cannon. Yeah, new item. Oh, all right. So that's where I can spend my gemstones at the cannon store. <laughs> yep, makes a whole lot of sense. And are they at all different? They just look a little different. I don't really care about that. And I can't unlock any other brushes. So it's not really seeing why people play this game still. <laughs> I'll, I'll give it one more try. Colgate and Oral-B can suck a fart out my ass because the truth is you only need a barbecue brush to get the job done. Really spreads the poop around. Oh, oh, wait, we got, we got spice. We're putting spice on Mexican mouths. That seems, um, debatable. <laughs> yeah, is debatable the word that I'm looking for right now? Oh my God, it is just so choppy. It's driving me crazy. I'm prepared for the cannon though. Auto clicker engage. Auto clicker? Auto clicker? Are you kidding me? The game can't even process clicks that are that fast. <laughs> no! Okay, you know what? These weird Wallace and Gromit heads can screw off. I, I, I don't want the bone. I don't want to continue. I'm, I'm moving on to yet another game. What the Christ am I looking at right now? <laughs> This is a game called Papui, which at first I just kind of assumed was like a sneeze. Papui. But I ran it through Google Translate and it turns out it's actually French for tickle, which is even more concerning in a game about licking things. What exactly am I supposed to be licking? Oh, oh, okay. Uh, we can... Avoid the arm fuzz. Yeah, I'm down for that. This is one real long arm. Um, wasn't there a hand at the other end? I 
definitely feel like I'm missing something. Oh, watch out for the titties. Did I win? I, I think I won. <laughs> I can tell you right now, this game is going to be the thumbnail for this video. I may have only played one level, but I'll ask you guys right now. Great game or greatest game? I'll let you be the judge. Should I have licked her shoulders? I, I, I know that it's called a tickle, and maybe this is just like a, a French thing? Maybe it's a cultural difference, but... <laughs> Something about the random patches of hair and the fact that that was just a floating two-footed leg that's really concerning. <laughs> oh, oh no, I, I keep thinking that I should move away from them, but then I instinctively dive into them. Really says a lot about me. What's really interesting here is that there's no store. We're not earning points. It seems like the objective is to just make your way across the... Lumps. Uh, lady, you might want to get that looked at. Never mind. I think you got bigger problems than lumps. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. You don't want to lick band aids because that would be failure. And then you just go back to the beginning? I saved this for last because I kind of figured that it was going to be the worst game that we played today. But it might actually be the best because it's by far the weirdest and it doesn't have any predatory monetization. You can't buy currency, you can't watch ads to unlock stuff, I'm not getting bombarded with ads, I just gotta lick my way down whatever is put in front of me. <laughs> I really enjoy it! Yeah, this is uh, eye-opening to say the least. Uh, do I need to get enough licks in or... Do I even need to bother? Could I just float my way through this? There we go. We actually dodged the titties for once. <laughs> but it looks like I just need to move forward. It doesn't matter how much licking I do. So what's the purpose in all this other than to make me giggle? It's got to get weirder, right? I refuse to believe that this is as weird as it can go. <laughs> Fuzz, sure. Uh, bracelets, all right. But where could we go next? How are we going to innovate on the... Licking strange floating body parts meme. I, it, it's gotta go somewhere. Come on. Hit me with something strange, please. I need more. What? Oh, there we go. That's shoulders attached to a foot. Am I losing my mind? There was a shoe on the other end, wasn't there? <laughs> Maybe it's all just blending together and I'm mistaken, but I could have sworn. Yeah, there's a hand on this end and it's backwards. Okay, I've played a couple more levels and I think I'm stuck on level 8. This might be the end of the game. Not really sure because I I'm wondering if you can beat it. Like, is there an ending? Are we going to get some kind of cutscene that explains what's happening here? Probably not, but it, it just it interests me. It's, it's not getting more difficult. We're not unlocking things. They're not throwing different obstacles at me. It, it's equally as weird throughout. It, it's like it's about the journey as opposed to the destination, <laughs> which really says something. I'm not sure what, but something for sure. We don't want to lick the bracelets or the watches, and then we always end up back at the fat titties and we're done. I feel the need to remind people that there are hundreds of millions of people playing these games right now. That's why I'm making this video, because there's such a massive trend. And now that we're approaching the end of our little journey, I still don't know why. I'm not seeing it. Of all the free forms of entertainment in the world, why would you choose to lick ice cream and poop and arms? It just doesn't add up to me. <laughs> or better yet, why would you watch somebody licking ice cream and poop in her? <laughs> oh, this is getting a little bit too meta for me. Okay, let's bring it home. Let's get back to the tatties and we're done. All right, you know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of licking games guys the google play store i play it so you don't have to i'm still not really sure what i want to brand this series as but i have made other episodes like this i did one for among us knockoffs i did one for runner games in general so if you guys want to watch those just check them out in the channel and if you want to see more stuff like this as always be sure to leave a like in this video leave a comment letting me know and maybe i'll lick stuff again soon but thanks so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time